All right, we're gonna shoot this video. Kaisenet, girl got leaked. Her name is uh, Layla Red Cakes. Absolutely crazy. She filmed him while she was in the bed with him. Like, don't have girls over, and then do not. If you don't trust them, you don't. You barely even know her. He Ubered her over, and now she's gonna film him and then try to, you know, scam him for five grand, saying that she paid him already. She never paid the girl. Like, it's all, it's all over here. The stories are crazy. We're gonna go, and then there's a guy that actually explains it pretty freaking well and that just got leaked and i'm not gonna lie with you he messed up extremely badly you didn't want to respond you thought i was gonna take the little chump change that you paid me not to say nothing no yeah, yeah, so basically through. what happened is that a few weeks ago, Kai met this person on the comm named Layla Red. Now for those who don't know, Layla Red is an OF model, and Kai decided to have her on his Twitch stream. I guess after the stream he had with her, Kai found her very attractive and decided to invite her over his house, did stuff together, and immediately after they finished up, Layla Red wanted to get paid $10,000 for the two times they met up in person. On April 2nd, Kai sent her $5,000, but he kept stalling for over a week and a half in payments to send her the full 10k, so she got upset and warned that if he doesn't send the full 10k that Layla Red will leak explicit pictures and videos she took of Kai Sinat while they were in bed. Now Kai thought she was gonna bluff cause if she actually posted the pictures of him naked he can easily sue her for revenge but because I guess with the combination of everyone thinking she was lying, Kai buying her domain and not getting her 10k she actually posted the explicit Kai pictures and this situation is gonna escalate even more. Now this whole situation was very votable for Kai and it's looking very bad at the moment three immediate lessons that we have going into this and Come on now, it's obviously don't have random girls over at your house and don't if you're gonna if you're gonna knock them out you know smash cheeks don't freaking leave them there to kick them out of the house now he like let, let her stay in the house and then woke up and then she was filming him the whole time and then at least he had receipts though like at least the dude had receipts it's straight up extortion man extortion to the highest degree I mean, and then she said that she doctored it because Kai Sinat, we're going to go through it. We're going to go through it all because it, it's funny. There's just like a lot of lessons here. It's just don't trust people and don't have people over. Kai's at a level where he doesn't realize that. I don't think he thinks that he's a celebrity that he is. But when you're that status, you're going to get targeted all the time. Girls are going to use you, especially if you don't have like a main girl. It's way better at this level to have just like a main girl. You're not be hoeing around with all these other tricks that are like gonna be playing you she's trying to target you from the very get-go trying to get her come up on you because you've already done all the work they don't care about they, they would have never talked to kai from the get-go they just like target him while he's on the come up he already made his money he's already there he's already in the spot so it's much easier to talk talk to him Car cardi says cardi b is following the playbook the girl copied the playbook it's gonna be the same playbook it's been the play same playbook since you know it's probably since there was ships and then conquistadors or something like oh he owns a ship i'm gonna go target this guy it's probably been the same thing let me get some doubloons you know like it's been the same thing this whole time bro. but we're gonna go and then see what she has to say uh, of course he was gonna come back with a story saying he gonna sue me how else was he gonna look good to the blog i mean you like a certified trick right now duh i don't know how he's like oh we taking people to court well she i'm ready to take you to court little p diddy jr Talking about you. Oh, yeah, I don't know how he's like a P. Diddy Jr. He's obviously nowhere near like a P. Diddy Jr. P. Diddy has full on mansion parties. Guy Sinet has like throwbacks in his, his little AMP house. You tried to sell me to one of your homies and all that shit. Don't forget about it. I got all that in the tea too. Receipt for that too. And by the way, yeah. I some more dumb shit. Y'all probably know. Okay. Okay. You probably know, bro. Okay. You know. All right, it's some dumb shit, clout chasing, weird ass shit going on right now, bro. But it's all right, though. It's all right, though, chat. I'll see you in court. That's her. <laughs> She's her making her face right here. Got you. <laughs> okay, listen to me. Okay, I can explain, bro. Listen to me, chat. I can explain, bro. I can explain, all right, chat? Um... Some weird shit going on right now. Some weird clout chasing shit going on right now, bro. And you know what's so crazy? Do you know that shit was in the beginning of 2023? All the shit that y'all see right now, it's 2023 shit, bro. You feel me? Like, god damn, bro. But yeah, we're not gonna talk about it no more. Let's not talk about it. Cleanse, 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 cleanse. Flowers, rainbows, ice mice. Come on. Cleanse, cleanse, flowers, rainbows, ice spice, sparkles. Let's go. Flowers, rainbows. He's saying that all that was back in 2023. So this lady's just coming out of nowhere with this. 
And then he had paid her. He goes into the into detail and he says, like, I paid her fifty dollars for an Uber to come over. But she's going on to all these talk shows and saying, all out of a sudden, like all of it, like it's April twenty twenty four. And that was back last year with, when they actually did their thing. And now she's bringing it all up all of a sudden. And of course, she's getting some clout that's following through. This is what the what happens when you have these things. But here is her, like right here. So, so what I see was the first word was. Here, let me pause it. Let me actually fix it up. So you said five, you said five racks. Like, yeah, you want to see? Let's see, let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Cause it's like, he's trying to cat me and shit like this shit fake. You feel me like, I don't somebody... like that shit. Like, look, let's go to the wallet. Look, they were saying something about some damn uh, wallet, I, I, iPad, look, I, I, I wallet. I, okay. Look, okay. Hold on. Not the trash. You got that money look, over here. Uh, she ain't playing around though. Look, look, hold on. Let's go to it. Keep going down. Let's, this real shit. Mm -hmm. Look, what's it say? It say yep. Right. It say who? Now this, it do say that. That was for an Uber. Yeah. But it say that too. It say that. Uh, too. So the Uber yeah, payments exactly. there. It was yes. never capped, and so you try to cap on my neck because you got a whole bunch of clout. Yeah. Nigga, that don't mean shit. You just yeah. got a whole bunch of millions that's following, but yeah. you capping all the motherfuckers because yeah. nigga, you paid. So come on now, y'all. She's just trying to make sure she's trying to verify his story that he paid her money, but right there the transaction was for the fifty dollars. So. What are you trying to, she's trying to say like, oh, you owe me the other $5,000. So if you go ahead and like Photoshop that you got $5,000, he's like, you owe me the other half. So is she doing all this just for $5,000? I know she's, she's an aspiring rapper, right? And she's, she's in music videos. She's on social media. So this I would say is like worth more than the $5,000, right? Yeah, yeah, Cake says, what's a passport, bro? Guys, if you're not on the, like, real quick, quick. If Monday, Wednesday, Friday, live stream starts at five. We're still in it a little bit early because I got to leave a little bit early. So you're missing all the chat. If you want to, you could watch the chat um, at the live stream on the channel. Make sure to go to the channel. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, five. Yeah, yeah, Cake says, what's a passport, bro? Yeah, men that look for abroad, abroad. That is great because it rhymes. So it's obviously true. Yeah, Cakes, you're missing out. It's because... It's because Cakes doesn't have to uh, worry about that. All the girls that are single are like, oh my God, the, I can't find a man because they're going, they're all going overseas. You know, the ones that are in the United States. I can't find a man. Uh, all the overseas girls are taking them. The, the, I hate passport bros. That's why it's breeding so much animosity for the passport bros. Anyways, we're getting back into the video. So we are, let's see, this one. Come on now, y'all. Of course he was going to come back with a story saying he going to sue me. How else was he going to look good to the vlog? So we're going to show that right here. Come on. So Kaisenet said he's going to sue her because he has an NDA. She signed an NDA to come meet. So that was smart of Kaisenet anyways. So I'll go ahead and have that NDA ready. Go ahead and do the rumor. Look at this guy. Look at this. Ma'am, you're cooked. You already posted receipts. Cut it out, Kira Rush. You're done, brother. It's funny because Kaisenet gave like a pro move. This is one of the third lessons learned is don't let, if your domain's going up for sale, don't let somebody come in and buy it. Chinese companies do that stuff all the time. You have to protect your domain name. <laughs> and she just let it go like without payment. And then Kaisenet swooped in there, bought the domain name, and now it links back. We're going to get into Kai, uh, Kaisenet's clap back here. So we got like her full story, right? So she went over, she said like, oh, Kaisenet owes me $5,000. Here's the Uber payment. He gave me $50 for the Uber. And then he paid me five G's. So, you know, spend the night with them, have some fun times. And now it's freaking April since that was back in 2023. And she's pretty much demanding $5,000 again. That's crazy. It's crazy because not even the freaking fresh and fit girl, Daisy Chin was demanding, is straight up demanding money like that. That's when you when you're messing with classy girls and then like ratchet girls. The Daisy Chin chick is like, oh, like I will uh Yeah, drop my freaking <laughs> drink. Kixie's like, what the hell? Yeah, yeah, Kixie owns all of the content by owning the domain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he switched up the content too on the website. So now he could just redirect everything. It's it's pretty smart. Well, we're gonna go, we're gonna get into the Kaisenet. We wanted we covered the backstory. We saw her. She I didn't show like where the actual video where she filmed Kaisen. All they, all she did was film him in bed. And then she had pictures of him, which apparently she exposed already. So she kind of screwed herself with that. She pretty much broke the NDA already. That's why Kaisen was like, yeah, we're going to see you in court. But right now, we're going to see this club. Back. Hold to my mother! Today. 
What am I dead? You getting fired today. What am I dead? You getting fired today. I'm gonna have you. I'm, I'm gonna say something real quick and say something real quick and say something real quick, chat. You are not t today, right now, for the next 20 minutes of my life. You are no longer talking to. You are no longer talking to who? Okay, some some dumb. Some dumb. You are no longer talking to. Kasanat. Getting sturdy, Kasanat, the streamer, Kasanat, this, that, and the third. You were talking about Kasanat from the Bronx. Your time has come. Listen to me. Yeah, so Kasanat, we typically see him. I know Yaya Kicks probably doesn't know, but we typically see him like playing all these jokes. He does, he does, has done a lot of film. He does like a lot of crazy stream. He's part of the group, the A and P group. If you don't know. He does like a lot of comedic stuff. He doesn't really do, doesn't tap into like serious stuff. We're not like, you know, thro threatening people or doing like nefarious actions or deeds, except for when he caused that little stop up in New York where they were saying that he was going to give away some uh, PlayStation systems or whatever. And that that caused a, uh, a riot. So then he got in trouble for that. He got detained. Um, I know the, there's a lot of trouble going on with that. That's the only like actual trouble or bad stuff going on with like Kaisenet's name really it's like this series but this one is like definitely different because now he's actually going he's targeting somebody it's not it's this isn't supposed to be a funny situation all these these situations typically are funny especially when it's not happening to yourself that's what i'm saying yeah the bell the undertaker let's get into it here's the thing chat word to my mother it happens all this they don't understand. Everything will come to light. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. <laughs> no weapon formed against me shall prosper. We done been here again. This will be the last time I'm doing it. But you, ma'am. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not addressing you as Layla Red. I'm now addressing you as Kiara Rush. Because that's who I'm talking to, Kiara. Kiara We're not calling you by your old name. We see that's like when all the YouTubers and all these streamers get mad, they always resort like doxing is the very first thing. Granted, she did the she's the one that went over the ledge first, right? She's posting all the stuff that she wasn't supposed to be posting and breaking an actual legal document. All Kaisenet Kaisenet's coming back with his is just buying up domains and then saying her real name because he, he's gonna have to say his real name her real name anyways, because when he goes through the receipts. It says Layla Red in the receipts. So either way, he's gonna have to dox it. But he didn't like. She went ahead and like she doxed him bad because she actually put his address in um, when she released all those pictures and everything and like had the video. His full up address was right there too. So she actually doxed him, and he's popular on a completely different scale than she is. We talk. We, we talking to Kiara. It's your time now. Look, okay. And yeah, 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 Cakes, he's, he's mad because, yeah, as what I just said, she actually doxed him and released pictures and released video trying to get, what? What did we see before? Like $5,000? That's all you're That's all you're going to get out of this? Five Gs and some clout? Five Gs and clout. But now you're going to get sued and the low, um, a defamation case is up to 100 Gs. So it's definitely not worth it to even do it, so. I'm going to get real disrespectful. So if I get banned, I don't give a f something come out. And I want to say some water, my mama, I don't give a Because ain't no way a think she could get away with a lie. Now you might wonder why, yo, Kai, hold on, Kai. Lie? Wait, you mean to tell me that the the $5,000 was capped? You mean to tell me that the other the $5,000 was capped? And this is why I may be a dumb okay, at certain scenarios. I may be stupid sometimes, but I'm not as dumb as you think. You might have thought you had the one up on me. No jumper, whoever wanna, whoever wanna, whoever wanna, whoever wanna record this shit, record it. Every block, I'm calling on Scuba Ryan, Fear Buck, Kira. All y'all record this shit. I don't give a no more. You're the last one. Here we go. First thing first. You tried it, okay? Congratulations. Your time has come. You're done. What are my mother? First things first, Kai, may you back up your claim? Oh, sure, I will. Oh, no, 
problem. As you guys may have seen, hold on. Let me take this alert off my screen real quick so you guys can see everything. Okay, here we go. First things first. And I know I'm not supposed to be doing this because this is attention towards her, but she has to be gone. I swear to God, I don't like when people try to play with me when I built up something from the ground up. Yeah, that's how I realized this is like when YouTubers and streamers or any social media guy is actually mad and they're smart about it, they won't even release the names, right? They won't say, because then that does, that just gives more clout. So then they can get what they need uh, out while not giving them more clout and helping them. It's dollars for dollars in that situation. So he's smart on that, but he's like, well, I got to now. Well, I, either way, I have to because I got to show these receipts. So that's what they do when they're actually getting mad. Like, you know, I'm not even going to say their name. You know, I'm just going to, I'll tell you guys what I need to say without actually linking back to the person because I don't want to give them anything. Not getting nothing else from me, pretty much. You're done. First things first. You guys may have seen this text. Okai sent $5,000 on October 4th at 12.29 p.m. on a Wednesday. <laughs> okay, you guys seen that, right? Okay. Oh, wait, there's another one. Wait, Kai, hold on. You also sent 5000 on November 10th. Of at, at 12.34 a.m. Okay, following me. Y'all following me? Watch this, chat. Okay. So let me see. That was October 4th and November. Cool, five, right? $5, you want to go ahead and lie and say, I sent you this money. Now, I could have easily went in my text messages and just easily just showed it. it. It just wasn't there. But I know that Twitter has the most annoying on the internet. Wait, Kai, you could just delete it, gang. <laughs> Kai, <laughs> That doesn't prove anything, Kai. You could just delete it. Hold on, you forgot. I'm 10 steps ahead. Let me cook. First things first. This is my phone. Here we go. Here we go. Screen record, as you guys can see. Thank you, Apple. That's true. I like how they do that. So it's like, oh yeah, Kai, you could just delete it, but then why couldn't they have the same logic and like, oh, she could have just Photoshopped this. You see, it's always, <laughs> it's always on like the, I would say, victim. I mean, he did do the deal. He got what he wanted from her. She got what she, well, now she's getting what she wanted. If at least it's just a clout, she's getting what she wants to, right? But he can, like, why, why isn't that logic always the same, especially when it comes to stuff that's on the internet? Like, oh, well, yeah, you, you just delete that. When you're probably trying to provide proof. I'm trying to provide proof, like trying to clear my name. But then now, like, oh, well, I could just delete it. Now what I'm providing is fake. But the person that you saw the initial stuff from, that's already assumed to be real it's a little bit backwards it's like the you're guilty already before you even get a chance to defend yourself apple for the wallet let's go to um transactions of 2023 um let's go to hmm, let me see october for me please okay as you can see these are my good friends um there's a escalate in there that my, my dudes get two thousand whenever whenever she wants she get whatever she want okay nothing there she saved as Layla Red in my phone. On God. You're saved as Layla Red in my phone. Kiara Rush. I'm on you now. Kiara Rush. We don't we call you KR now. Alright? Go to November. Stop! Stop! Flyer artist. Flyer artist. Hairstylist. Facial lady. Flyer artist. Layla fing red! $50 for your dumb ass over. $50 for the Uber, not even, that's, she just came over to the crib to get Cheeks clapped. That's why this is a clap back. She came over to the crib to get Cheeks clapped, and then there was not even a meal in there. It's just <laughs> hairstylist, facial lady, flyer, the chick, and then hairstylist again. She didn't get no meals. She didn't get no movies. Just straight to the house with the Uber. Kai got it shipped in direct. That's that one day Amazon. <laughs> she got it straight direct. Cheeks clap. <laughs> oh, God. I think that's another reason why she's trying to seem like she, oh, like, no, Kai said that paid me $5,000 because then she doesn't seem as cheap. Like she just gave it, gave it for free and it hopes in exchange for clout. And hopes in exchange for some type of notoriety. Maybe he like like it enough that she can he can keep calling her back or something. But just yeah, no, nothing in between there. That's just straight straight cheeks claps. I got you. Over. 
fifty dollars. What you talk about, nigga? Stop talking, about yo. What am my mother? Let me tell you, nigga, something, bro. When you see like Yaya Cake says she gave it for free, it's not even for free though. It's for it's in the hopes. It's like uh, it's like the bite you buy the lottery tickets, right? So you go and buy a lottery ticket. You're not. It's not like oh, I just gave the money directly. I just gave the government money. It's in you gave the money in hopes that you would get something bigger in return. That's the key. You didn't just give the money like oh, I'm just gonna give away money. So she didn't give the she didn't give the cheeks away for free. She there was a hidden cost, like a hidden like okay, maybe I put my ticket in there and he might like it a lot, and then you know I could string this along a little bit. It, it wasn't for free, or maybe Kai just looks that good and then you know girls see it as a win win. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, stop speaking on me, bro. Hold on, I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. <laughs> yeah, for yeah, $50. You got in the Uber and came here. Now I'm out of crap. I don't give a fuck, bro. I don't give a fuck. Ma, if you see this, I apologize, Ma. I had to, bro. I had to. $50 to hop in a fuck Uber. Bet. Cool. Kai. Okay. Wow. Okay. You have now proved that you only, the only receipt there is, is you $50? So wait, hold on. Hold on, Kiara Rush. So not only did you lie, but you Photoshop and these dumb niggas really ran with it? Really? Oh, you smarter than I thought. That's why we need more. That's why we need more. Hold on. Green. Green, nigga. Splash. Okay. Let's move on. Next. Let's move on. Hold on. I'm not done. I'm not done. Hold on. First things first. Here's the thing. I don't know if you, I don't know if you know, sweetheart. I don't know if you know. Okay. I don't know if you know, but let's get serious real quick. Let's get let's real go. serious real go. quick. Again, okay, I never speak on it because I go through so much that I never bring it to the internet and I don't give a f I'm going I'm to let it out today. Last year of January 2023, my mans was lied on. Okay? Lied. Okay? Lied for an incident that has no jokes to be with and I should have. I, I, I speared you. I speared you. I speared you. I let you drag my name there was a scenario in january of 2023 that was very serious and millions of people seen it yeah i think he was talking about the one where his friend got it because like oh you like kai you were set up you set up people that is where he was kind of like p diddy because like he had this little house party and he's like setting people up and then the, one of the friends says she got great there that's like or like sh you know at the party and then it's like everybody was even though kai Sinet wasn't directly blamed it was him that he was he was the host so he has alternative blame for that situation because he's the one that brought the situation together. So then you're going to get blamed for that. And then that's why that's the situation that he's talking about right now. And I was on the verge of stop doing what I'm doing just because of a that want to lie. It never got to court because it was a lie. And I kept my mouth shut because you feel me? But, 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 but I really should have got you too. But congrats to Kiara Rush. You are now the example. Okay. You are not the example. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah. Cake says a uh, crappy woman with crappy man making crappy content. And Exile says, I see this happen a lot in the future. Yeah, true, 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 true. It's saying the standards. But you see, there's always people that are above the standards. It just so happens that this stuff gets highlighted more. It's like the same thing like with the good cops and the bad cops. The bad cops, everybody's like, oh, yeah, cops are all shitty. It's like, no, those are just the cops that keep getting highlighted the most. There's way more good cops than there is bad cops. Like, how there's way more good women, way more good men than there is bad men. But then the bad men and the bad women get highlighted way more because it's a talking point. And it's good for clicks and it's good for views. Hence why we're talking about it now. It's because it sets a good example of what not to be. You can learn from good and then you can learn from the bad. So you can utilize both. It's just way more fun to utilize the bad in these situations let's be let's be completely honest that's why the drama is good let's keep going do you not think after what happened in january right do you not think i am now 10 steps ahead of everything that i do do you not think i know that i'm one of the biggest streamers to walk this earth and i'm not 10 steps ahead I'm sorry because I'm I'm so humble, but I don't want I don't want to snap, bro. But I'm not ten steps ahead of everything people do, and say I'm ten steps ahead of you, okay? First things to first, shorty. Do you know what an NDA is? Let me do you know what an NDA is? Not a social agreement. Are legally enforceable contracts. Do you know that what an NDA is? Relationship between a person who has sensitive information and a person who will gain access to that information, okay? 
A confidential relationship means one or both parties has a duty not to share that information, okay? Which you signed, Kiara Rush. You signed that, Kiara Rush. You did. You did, and it protects me from everything that we've ever talked about or ever, ever talked about. It's cool, though, because you, you, you let shit out, right? Wait, and lie. Hey, that's so... How is that? How is she sign an NDA and then come... Is it... The clout is not worth it. You have to... For this to be worth it in the short term and in the long term, she would have had a full-fledged plan to monetize this whole situation appropriately, which it doesn't look like she did because Kai Sinat went and then bought her domain to her website. Maybe she gets a couple more OnlyFans subscribers or a couple more streams because I she has her music videos and her music, but that's not going to cover the $100,000 cost of getting hit with that NDA. That's if Kai Sinat wants to be nice to pull the NDA, which it doesn't look like he's going to, since he's already being savage and then taking away some of her other income since she was not smart enough to keep her domain name safe. Hi, right, by the way, you're a liar. Liar! Liar! You're a liar! You're a liar! Next! Next! Oh no! Wait, hold on, Kiara. What did you post to me, Kiara? Not only did you sign an NDA, but you also, while I was sleeping, butt ass naked. Decided to just post me online. Yeah. Okay? Now, what do you call that, ladies and gentlemen? Revenge, revenge porn. porn. I yeah, also yeah. don't know what revenge porn... Okay, she didn't... She didn't... She didn't, she, she blocked the out of shit, okay? For those who don't know what revenge porn is, revealing or sexually explicit image or videos of a person posted... But then he says that he's 10 steps ahead, but then dealing with girls like this, there's... I don't know. I'm not at his level, obviously, but I would assume that there's... I know that it is with the NBA. There's like specific girls that are dealt with but they're paid and there's like certain relationships i don't know if streaming is such it's not like such a mainstream thing it looks mainstream because of the viewership but it's not like a mainstream career that is obviously guaranteed where they have specific subsets of girls that can be trusted that you could deal with type of thing which I wouldn't even want to deal with that anyways. It's going to be like Mark Wahlberg and just get a waitress or something that you can actually trust in the end. In the end, when you're in these positions, it's always better to just have your main girl because of situations like this. Especially if you're not going to keep the girl around. It it's, just makes the whole situation so risky and you're too valuable. And Kaisenet knows he's too valuable to be put in these types of situations on the internet typically by former sexual partner without the consent of the object and in order to cause okay oh wait there's more or now uh -huh. despite what happened in january i've made it my duty to never ever be lied on again in my career do you hear me i made it my duty to never ever be lied on again in my career i may be dumb when i'm on a stream but i'm not a dumb for real you must have not remembered as you were talking to me in our last encounter. I don't know if you noticed, but you were recorded with voice 4K audio of you threatening me to post images for money. <laughs> oh, oh, you didn't think I was 10 steps ahead. Oh, when, when my phone was like this on my lap. Oh, when my, when my phone was like this on my lap. Oh, you, oh, you didn't think I, 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 I recorded, right? Hold on. Run the audio, Your Honor. Let me cook on these real quick. Let me cook on these real quick. Run the I gotta give him respect though, like to actually be recording. And but you see, so there's respect that I'm given, obviously, because he's taken precautions to this situation. But I'm kind of taking it back because he's at a level where he doesn't need to put himself in these situations in the first place. He just get better quality girls. You see how like super ratchet, we saw the videos previously, how super ratchet that chick is. I mean, there's, I know he was, he was trying to get Tyla. I know that, that that's a step up from this girl right here. But he's smart enough to not be put in these situations in the first place is my biggest thing. If he's smart enough to be 10 steps ahead and do all these preparations and record people, have receipts and all that stuff, buy domains, then he's smart enough to not even be put in these situations in the first place, dealing with these kind of ratchet girls, man. The audio, listen closely, please. Here we go. I will replay it right after. Here we go. Me, for a photo, for money, 
Hey, you, you took a picture of me without my consent. consent. Naked. So? Revenge porn. So? <laughs> That's so revenge porn. Right. You, but you're threatening it. You're threatening to. You're threatening to, though. But you're threatening to, though. Yeah, because you're going to resolve it. I know, but it's still a crime. Okay, it's still a crime. I'm not messed up, though. That's all I'm saying. I'm not messed up. It's still a crime, though. I don't hold it. I'm sure the thousands of you have to do it. I know, but you'll get in trouble, though. It's coming from you. You're the source. So you've you've, ad, you've source text messages. You've admitted. Admit. You've admitted. You've admitted. You've admitted. Yeah, but bro, it makes, makes no sense. sense. I'm just telling. I'm not blaming me for a photo, mm-hmm. for money, Never say and you took a picture of me without my consent, naked. So revenge porn. I ain't posted. That's revenge porn. You th- but you're threatening. Yep. You're threatening to. One more time. You're threatening to though. One more time. See that they're dealing with that sh- like. I don't want to cuss too much, but dealing with that type of shit, like, where she's like, so, like, the ratchet people just don't have anything to, like, if you're super ghetto and shit, like, I can't, you can't be around people that just aren't living for anything. They don't care about anything. Like, so, I'll do whatever, I'll do whatever I want. I didn't send it. Call the police. Whatever. Do, like, dude, I, I don't, you don't have time to be dealing with that. I'm too busy trying to make money. I'm too busy trying to work. And you're over here just not giving a fuck about anything and then threatening me with it and then saying, tell, telling me to call the police. Unless he likes that kind of back and forth, like maybe that gets him turned on. That shit is not for people of that caliber, man. Unless he just likes that stuff. Some people like it. Some people like their girls to be beating on them and shit. But it's not worth the stress when you are, your life is already stressful. I know streaming may not look like it's stressful, but at this level, it sure is a hell stressful, man. But you're, th- you're, you? you're threatening to. One more time! I know, but it's still a crime. Okay, it's still a crime. I'm not messed up, though. That's, a, that's what I'm saying. I'm not messed up. It's still a crime, yeah, though. I don't post it. Call the police! Sure. The thousands of yeah, but, I, to, we'll post it. I know, but you'll get in trouble with all that. <sighs> all right, let me read the chats real fast. So, yeah. yeah, you missed it? They were fake? Oh, sure, yeah. AI didn't even exist and dude made them. What are you talking about? <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, exactly. Exile knows. He said he'll pass on these freaking ratchet chicks. Ridiculous. It's coming from you. You're the source. How would I you, get you've ad- you've the source? You've text messages. You've admitted. I don't have text messages. You've admitted. I don't have text admitted. messages. Yeah, but, bro, it makes no sense. I'm just telling you, I'm like blaming me for a photo. Mm-hmm. For money. Okay. Not only do I have that in 4K, correct? Now. She's panicking right now. Kiara, I know you're watching this. Hey. <laughs> huh. Hi. Okay. <laughs> now, look, Kiara. Here's the thing, Kiara. You probably like, oh, no. Hell no. He can't do that shit. He's recording without my headset. What the f is going on? I live in Georgia. Bitch. I do not live in New York. I do not live in Vegas. Bitch. Read this law. In-person conversations. An individual can record in-person conversations where either the person is a party to the conversation or at least one of the participants has consented to the recording. According to Georgia Code. So Kai is going hard, though. He has all the freaking laws at his disposal. He knows what the hell he's talking about. He's not playing around. He's a recorded her. He has receipts. He's doing good. 16, 11, 62, 66. He's doing good. Okay. Now, Kiara, hold on. Russian world boss, pick up your bomba clad self. Thank you for the 50 gifted. Now, now, Kiara. Now, Kiara. Not only did I just fry it. But I also warned you multiple times over and over again because you try to lie on me. Because if you guys recall, this came out like last week on some small. Shit. I never addressed it. I told her, yo, chill. We can move on. We can be good. I got text messages saying like, yo, chill. Like, I don't want to. You feel me? Like. Ah, so that's interesting. So Kai was trying to be the bigger person here. Like, hey, hey, I saw what you did. You just released some shit. That directly affects me, but stop doing that shit, and then I'll ignore what the hell you're doing. I don't have to blast you. And then she she guns and pushes. She wants money. 
This is why I'm assuming her friends, because if she just like barely released it and it didn't get any traction at first, she must have did something. And then she she went on different podcasts and shit trying to show that her photo her uh, Photoshop receipts and then tried to make a big spectacle. Now it's gained traction. So now he has to clap back. He tried to be a bigger person and be like, stop doing that shit. Chill. Feel me? And she still took the step and flew away. Finish her. Listen to me. Now, Kai, how will she pay for this consequence? How will, how will we make sure that this doesn't happen again? One, Kai, stop with these type of Yeah. So there, there it is. Stop messing with the, these ratchet chicks, man. Get some high class girls. You wanted to date Tyler? Date Tyler. He asked Tyler out directly in chat. I don't know if you, yeah, yeah, cakes and eggs. He, he asked Tyler, he's like, would you date me? I think she said no. She's busy. She's focusing on her career right now. But yeah, first lesson stop messing with ratchet chicks. Get higher class chicks. Son, that happened last year. I don't even have it two years ago. You are, t- you are way too, you feel me? Like, stop fucking with these types. That's it. I ain't gonna lie. These this what? You feel me? And you might be like, yo, Kyle, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What else though? Not only will I be suing this for everything that she has, I don't give a fuck if you have $15. I don't care if you have five. We're gonna take it to court. Would I drop the money to make an example out of you to make sure that this isn't happening? Absolutely. You're done, okay? Now, my lawyer's on the top of the top. <laughs> And I don't want to go into depth with that. But I will see you in court. I don't got to speak to that and shit like that, okay? We're going to make sure that you learn your lesson and that this doesn't happen to anybody else that encounters with you. Now you might ask, Kai, how the will you prevent this from happening to the public? Oh, Kai, you're 10 steps ahead. Indeed I am. First thing first, at the time of this, when I heard about this incident... I took it upon myself. I don't think his father, I don't know exactly what his father does. Uh, Yeah, yeah, I keep saying she's 100% butthurt he didn't want it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. That's funny. Yeah, I keep saying entertaining the masses, though. That's funny. It's funny stuff. Uh, Yeah, not for 5K. That's nothing. I don't know if his father's real. I mean, but Kai's well off enough that he can, you know, set his father up in different positions. I don't know exactly what his father does, but Kai's doing just fine and can set his diet up with like a nice good job probably in media doing something to buy your domain Layla I bought your domain because you didn't buy it when you first started your career didn't you so Layla I have bought your domain now you might ask what does that mean Kai it means every time somebody types in Kiara Rush Anytime somebody types in Layla Red, the first website that they will click on is all the lies you've told me, all the crimes you've done, all the dumb shit you just put yourself in to fuck up your life. So no, your OF link won't pop up first. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, Pornhub or anything like that won't pop up first. Oh, Dude, no. that's a pretty mystique. That's some good stuff right there. I don't know. I don't care who you are. That's some like evil genius planning right there. So he can, and he's he's rich enough to just keep that going forever, right? It's having a domain name in like a cheap website is is easy. You can just maintain that for the next 10, 20 years. Or that's it. And then now every time like a business looks her up for work, you know, when everybody's trying to give her some money, trying to type her name in, trying to search her like, oh, she looks good. Let me look at her picture. She's going on the podcast. That's just going to show up. And then he has enough money to pay for like good SEO, so to make sure it beats all the other links. <laughs> That's some evil stuff. No, 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 no. Hey, dude. The top link will be Kiara Rush, okay? Showing everything that you've done, okay? And you made a mistake with me. Now I know you don't understand the streaming world, and I know I know you don't understand what's about to happen, but you wanted your attention, correct? I currently have one hundred and fifty thousand demons in this ready to eviscerate you and take you off the internet forever for good okay for good okay don't with me i'm not to be with at all okay now listen i bought your domain so i'm sorry apologize that you feel me now kiara 
I would say just that threat alone, the followership in itself is super scary too. I don't know if you guys have seen what fol followers can just destroy somebody's life and that shit would be like on accident. I don't know, there's multiple stories out there where somebody like was mad, this other you know personality was mad, this other personality, they sent their followers over and after they got doxxed or something and just ruined their life. Or just even could be like a normal person. You see that happen with like reviews, some, like a restaurant goes viral or does something, you know, nefarious on like Reddit or something and followers go, people on the internet go and they just destroy that re review bomb the restaurant, actually order fake stuff. Like sending followers after somebody is insane. What's your last option? Your last option is to do something really dumb that will put you in jail for the rest of your life. Or something like that. Now, before you decide to crash out and do some weird shit, just know I have your address as well. Um, and I also have 10 big body security guards around my whole house ready to pop a nigga if he try. You understand me? Um, please don't do nothing dumb. Please. Don't do nothing dumb. Hey, rifles. Outside. Waiting. Please, please, please don't do nothing dumb. Now, I'm going to make a statement very broad. Any girl or male or anybody who decides to fuck with me, in GTA, of course, in GTA, of course, any male, any guy who decides to fuck with me, you will now feel, you will feel the power of Kaisenet. He's doing exactly what the courts do when they want to make an example out of somebody. They throw the whole freaking book at him. You're getting, and like that one uh, dude out of Las Vegas, Clark County, that jumped over the stand and attacked the judge. We did a video on that. He got, when he showed back up to court, he was restrained, had the mouth grill on, like Hannibal Lecter or something. And then he got every felony down the list because of that. They were making an example. This is exactly what Kaisenet's doing right now. Making an example to not screw with him again. And I would take, I would take freaking warning to this because you can send followers, he'll buy you out of stuff. Like she's, she's pretty, she is done. As the video is titled, it's titled correctly, Kara Rush, you're done. I have baked you into a chicken biscuit on a Sunday night. I don't know what- <laughs> Yaya Kicks, the Yaya Kicks doesn't know who Kaisen Hat is. Yeah, he's definitely rich enough for 24-7 security. He makes more than enough money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Exile knows. Exile knows. What's going on? But anyone who decides to f with me, I'm a, this is a warning shot. And if Yaya Kicks is looking at his room and be like, oh, well, that room looks super cheap. His chair has duct tape on it. The ceiling has patches in it. The floor is all dirty. The walls are dirty. Look at that door. It looks like it's about to fall off. He he does all of that for, um, that's all for show. Because it doesn't, it's not as appealing to like, you can't relate to normal people when you have super nice surroundings like that. Like even my, my background is probably too nice. So he keeps his the way it is so he can be more relatable. I am not, I am not, I'm no longer going to be, I'm, I'm, I'm focusing on me. I'm focusing on streaming. I'm focusing on what I, the broader things I want to do in life. Okay. Please do not f with me. Please. Let me be happy on this stream. Let me dance for the people I love. Let me do what I gotta do. Okay? <laughs> do want... Chat's going crazy saying 5'5 five, five, villain. Kaisen uh, that's uh, short as hell. But he's cool though. Okay. Now! <laughs> Thank what... you, Yaya yeah, Kicks. I look poor and very relatable. What's next for the night? Oh, I'm not gonna hop off stream and just act like you feel me. I'm saying like, you know, happened. I'm off this. No, 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 no. First things first, we're gonna do. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Kiara, we're not done with you. Not only. What is this? I haven't even seen this. Did you lie? But you made me a bag. Shout out to, to, to Rocky Paddle for the cigars. Shout out to y'all. This is sponsored by Rocky Paddle. This is sponsored. This <laughs> what the hell? Cigar 
It's sponsored by. <laughs> so he's he's getting sponsored. That's gonna help pay for the lawyers later on. <laughs> Rocky paddle. Select your cigar. Uh, we got Fredo. We got Layla. I'll have that one. Give me that. Okay. <clears throat> and I'm going to make sure that um I'm going to make sure that we smoke on you. Sponsor stream. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's like, unmute the audio. He's not listening. I don't. I don't think he smokes cigars. <laughs> He's just. I don't think he smokes one. I think that's it. Cool. That was it for that. Yeah. So he clapped back appropriately. I think he had all the bases covered, had all the legalities of everything. He recorded the situation, bought the domain names of all of that stuff. He has armed security guards, told him to come over if you want. He had the receipts. All of that stuff was covered. He says he's 10 steps ahead and he's not going to mess with these type of girls anymore. That is it for the stream, guys. Thanks for stopping by once again. I'll see you on Friday five o'clock uh maybe a little bit early i don't know we'll see but that was it for the video too see you next time peace 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 peace